believe the response to my my YouTube video. It has been absolutely fantastic. All of the comments on YouTube and TikTok is actually overwhelming and I apologize if somebody's commented and I haven't got back to you. Really gonna be something that I steer towards next year. However, I am gonna be sticking on TikTok. That is not gonna change. Currently, I do have a few ideas up my sleeve. I'm gonna be probably doing a, a talking head video about all of the cars that I've owned, breaking them down a lot more in detail, which is 20 something, so there's a few a fair bit in that. Um, I've got to still repair the distributor and everything on the VT. I'm going to do a walk around of the VT, the same style that I did in the VN. And uh, I'd like to do the other cars too. It's a little bit trickier with these other two cars. They are still great. They aren't as interesting as the Cam Manual VN. It's just a V6 Auto VSU. But I'll still do a video on it. Hopefully, uh, hopefully some people still like them. I, I still love this VSU. Hopefully you guys can tolerate me blabbering on, you know, for a few more minutes. Like I said, cars are my passion. I can legitimately talk about this forever. I don't know. I have no scripts. I don't really even know what I'm going to say before I press record. I just stand in front of the camera like I am now and make it up as I go along. Sometimes it means that it is a bit disjointed, but it also means that it's all coming from here and here. And so it's, it is genuine. I, I, try and, I try and be myself as much as I can. And uh, anybody that knows me, Knows that I don't shut up about these cars, so that is what I'm trying to put out. 2024, I think, is going to be a really good year for me. I'd, I'd really love to add some cars to this shed. I'd love to get a Kinga. I'd love to get a VL. Again, they're very expensive, so I'll see see how it happens. But right now, I'm going to focus on the L67. I'm going to focus on fixing the VT and uh, see where we go.